Hello, my name is Brandi Young and I am an InfoHio iLibrarian. I would like to take this opportunity to introduce you to InfoHio's iSearch. To get to iSearch, go to www.infohio.org and make sure that you are logged in to the InfoHio website. You will find iSearch on any of the student resource pages. For our purposes, let's start on the All InfoHio Resources page you'll find the iSearch search box at the top of the list. Before we start searching, let's discuss the advantages of iSearch. iSearch is the starting place for all types of research. With just one click, you are searching multiple resources that are reviewed for accuracy. iSearch is a safe and valuable alternative to the internet. iSearch also makes it easier to find resources on your reading level. Now let's dive in and begin searching. I'm going to do a search on global warming Let's talk about our resource tabs. On the My Library tab, you'll find all the books and videos available in your school library, along with all the ebooks and digital videos available from InfoHio's ebook collections and digital video collection. You can limit to items from one library in your district by clicking the filter on the left. To get more information about an item in your library, including location and call number, Click the item title. On the Basic Sources tab, you'll find articles, reports, and primary sources written at the reading level just right for elementary, middle, and even early high school students. The Advanced Sources tab shows you the same kinds of resources as the Basic Sources tab, but written at a reading level for older middle school students and high school students. Choose whichever tab works best for you. The Basic and Advanced Encyclopedia tabs are organized at the same reading levels as the Basic and Advanced Sources tabs. Use these when you're just starting research and need good, reliable background information. You'll find science-related articles, videos, and diagrams on the STEM tab. On the More Advanced tabs, you'll find a research starter at the top of your results. These are articles from trustworthy academic encyclopedias that give you background information on your topic. To get the full text of any item in your results list, click the View Download button. This will open a new tab. From here, you can access the full text and depending on the article, save it to the cloud or to Google Classroom. To get back to your search, exit out of that tab. On the results page, you have the option to save items to a list. Select the check boxes next to the items that you want to save and from the Select an Action drop-down, choose Add to My List. This is a temporary list that you can save by logging into your library account. Use the tabs across the top to first easily search through all the results. Narrow your search by clicking the terms along the left-hand side. You can narrow by source type, subject, publication, language, geography, and content provider. Choose the More or Expand All button to see more options. As you can see, using iSearch is a great way to search multiple resources with one click. Thank you for learning about InfoHio's iSearch, the starting place for all types of research.